Welcome to Belly Dance Biz Builders. I'm Orit, dancer, instructor, and proud owner of a thriving belly dance business. In this podcast, I'm giving it to you straight, revealing what it takes to kickstart and grow your dance business for the income you deserve. If you're a seasoned instructor, a passionate performer, or dreaming of turning your love for belly dance into a thriving business, you're in the right place. Tighten up those hip scarves and join me on a ride of truth smacks, tips, and inspiration. Let's do this. Welcome to episode 24 of the Belly Dance Biz Builders podcast. Hi, I'm Orit and I am your host. And we are continuing the teaching series of teaching tips of how to get students to stick. So the past two episodes, I talked about two elements. The first one was breakdown and buildup of movement and how you're executing your class. How are you actually teaching the class? After that, we talked about cueing. Are your students able to go from move to move seamlessly with your cueing? Yeah. And now this last part that ties it all together and that helps you do those first two elements is music and specifically nonstop music. Here's the deal. So when you have music that has pauses in between each song, it stops the flow of the class. It stops someone's attention. Yeah, you want them to always be engaged. So when you have music that is nonstop and it flows from one song to the next, that is ideal. And that enables you to not stop. It enables you to think about what the next move will be. It enables you to not talk so much. And it also enables you to maybe get their heart rate slightly elevated. Yeah, which is not a bad thing. Yes. Now you can create your own nonstop mixes very easily simply by using Audacity. It's a free tool that you can use for PCs or you can use GarageBand. Again, a free music editing tool that if you have a Mac. But at Sharky, we go a little further with it. We don't just use any song and we just try to connect them, even if the songs have different tempos and fluctuating rhythms. Our music is on the 32 count. That means there are four phrases of eight. But here's the key with our music. It has a steady beat. So we're not teaching to the musical structure but we're just simply teaching to the beat. And every song has a beat, yes? And that enables you to teach any type of class. You can teach a strength class. You can teach a traditional fitness fitness class. You could even still teach a traditional belly dance class. If the songs have the same steady beat, you can still do it. Oh, and another benefit, nonstop music, helps you to pack it all in. You're able to do more because the music is still going. You then have to still teach. You then have to still cue, break down, and build up. So do you understand how music ties it all in? And that's really the most important element that enables you to do all the breakdown, build up, and the cueing. Well, I invite you to join the September to December cohort of the Sharky Instructor Academy. You're going to learn all that and more, not just how to teach effectively and in a way that really gives a lot of value to your students and you can pack more in, but we will also teach you how to do the business side of your dance business. We don't just leave you alone. We also have an amazing community of instructors. So if you are interested learning more, feel free to hop on a no obligation call with me at sharkey.com slash teach. And that is S-H-A-R-Q-U-I 
dot com slash teach. Guys, this is going to be an amazing and transformative training for you. You can't stay stagnant. As teachers, we've got to always learn different skills, different tools, because think about it. You're going to have different kinds of people coming to your classes. Understanding and learning how to teach a different way just makes you more marketable. And it's one more thing to put in your toolbox. All right, folks, I hope this helped. Until next episode, go and kick ass.